Imagine stepping off this cliff and not falling. Imagine floating weightless, breaking free from the invisible chains that bind everything to Earth. It's humanity's oldest dream, conquering the most relentless force in the cosmos. Before you scroll past thinking this is just another science lesson, hold on. What if blocking gravity is one of physics' most baffling challenges? A story that takes us to the very edge of reality, so stay with me. Let's ask a simple question. Can we turn gravity off? Gravity is the universe's ultimate sculptor. It pulls you into your chair, holds the moon in its celestial dance around our planet, and gathers cosmic dust into burning stars. For centuries, Isaac Newton gave us our best picture of gravity. His universal law described how every object with mass pulls on every other object. The more mass, the stronger the pull. The farther apart, the weaker it gets. Then Einstein offered a completely different story. In general relativity, gravity isn't a force at all. Massive objects bend the fabric of space-time. Objects follow curved paths through this warped space, that's what we call an orbit. We've mastered electromagnetic forces. We can block electricity with rubber, redirect magnetism with metal. Electromagnetism has two sides, positive and negative charges that can cancel each other out. Gravity only has one charge, mass. Everything with mass attracts. There's no anti-gravity to cancel it out. You can't build a gravity shield because any shield material has its own mass. It's like trying to build a dam out of water. The material is the very thing you're trying to stop. A gravity shield would need to perform cosmic surgery on space-time itself. Gravity passes through Earth as easily as it passes through you. Every particle in your body responds to space-time's curvature. Gravity isn't knocking on the door, it is the architecture of the house itself. Russian scientist Eugene Podklitnov claimed to reduce gravity using a spinning superconducting disk. Objects above the disk seem to weigh less, not full anti-gravity but a weakening effect. NASA tried to replicate it. Despite numerous attempts by skilled teams no one could reproduce the results. Science fiction explores exotic matter with negative mass that could theoretically repel normal matter. These remain mathematical constructs. We have no evidence such matter exists. For now, it remains in the realm of imagination, tantalizing but unreachable. We arrive at the heart of the matter. Gravity isn't a force to be shielded, it's the dynamic stage on which the cosmic play unfolds. Asking to block gravity is like a character trying to erase the page it's written on. We are connected to the cosmos in the most intimate way imaginable. We're not just living in the universe, we're part of its geometric destiny. Next time you drop your keys, see it as a personal experience with space-time curvature. Our journey to understand these cosmic truths is just beginning. Subscribe to Universal Universe for daily cosmic adventures, and don't forget to share and like this video. Keep looking up, the universe is waiting.